so a couple of days ago, I started playing War of the Monsters, a game that I absolutely loved when I was younger. It's a game where you basically play as all of those massive monsters from those old B-movies and beat the absolute crap out of each other. And if you haven't played this game, you need to. One of my favourite things to do in this game was to pick up one of these tankers and then throw it. <laughs> it just... No, you take down whole bloody buildings. And I was thinking to myself, damn, I wish there were more games like this. And it turns out there are. This is Ultraman, a Japanese series that I've never seen. I know of Ultraman. I've seen him in pictures. That's it. And this led me down a rabbit hole of really good games that I think a majority of people in the West have never played. So that's what we're going to do in today's video. <laughs> Cabbage. That's what that says. But why I absolutely love these games is this. You basically get to kick the crap out of guys in rubber suits and that is amazing. Um... <laughs> When I say these games are fun, I'm not lying. They're really bloody good. And as I said at the start of this, I don't think a majority of people in the West have played these games. Look at this. I'm playing as Ultraman, throwing a, a rip-off Godzilla. <laughs> now, I will say the game is in Japanese and I have no idea what's going on. But you know what? As long as I get to beat up things, I don't care. And where gameplay comes in, these games are absolutely fantastic. And we're going to look at a few today. Um, but I just wanted to show you this. I'm getting my ass handed to me right now. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, it's fine. I'm okay. Ultraman will save the day in style. Ah. <laughs> I love it. I just love the animations, they're so good. And it's honestly almost like they've deliberately made it look as retro as possible, and I love that. It's so clever. <laughs> Why did I do that? <laughs> Go, Ultraman! Throw him! I'm gonna send him into space. That's literally what I'm doing right now. Oh my god, this is the best game ever made. And... Attack! <laughs> yeah, so this one has a time limit and you have to beat the story to unlock the versus mode. Uh, now, in the future games, that isn't the case. And that's what we're going to move on to next. By the way, I love <laughs> the, the, the continue of the game over screen is just his face. He looks so disappointed. This is Ultraman Nexus, released an entire year later, and it's the first one that I played a couple of days ago. This is what got me in to playing these games. And I really like this one for one simple thing. So uh, not only do we actually get a versus mode, so we're going to play as Ultraman, we're also going to go up against other Ultraman. This is Ultraman 2, um, <laughs> his brother. I don't know. I love the camera angle in this game. You're basically looking up at the Ultramen fighting, and I absolutely bloody love that. Um, we're just gonna kick this guy's ass. <laughs> it feels weighty, and I really bloody like it. And the fact this is on PS2 is pretty impressive. Like, the games we'll look at later are even more impressive than this. And I personally think this looks absolutely fantastic. Now, I am, of course, resing this up to 1080p. Um, I am getting my ass handed to me here, so let's try and take him down. Oh, come on, come here. <laughs> I normally fight the big... Bloody, ah, Godzilla-type monsters. We're going to do a special here. And Ultraman lasers. There they are. Oh, wow. Oh, they're so powerful. Oh, I didn't see that one. Oh, no. Hang on a minute. He's doing Ultraman lasers. What's that? I've, oh, my God. I'm dead. <laughs> okay. He won. All right. It's fine because this is two rounds. This is the craziest video I've ever made. Um, this has no structure, literally. It's just going to be me uh, nerdgasming over these really fun little games that I think you need to check out. Um, because I think these are hidden gems. Like, 
In Japan, I'm assuming that these games were pretty big. But over here, I'd never heard of Ultraman. Um, so, it's something that I really like finding new things that I hadn't played growing up because I was a big PS2 player back in the day. I had a PS2. I remember playing a ton of games like, of course, San Andreas, War of the Monsters, uh, a ton of really great games. Oh, suck it. Come on. Ah, no, no. <laughs> okay, so that one's a little bit more 2D fighter, but they get more interesting. This one is really good. This is Ultraman 3 Fighting Evolution 3. I don't know where the 3 lies. And if you thought you'd seen Ultraman, you've not met Ultramen, uh, because they're all here. Uh, Barry, Clive, uh, Jason, and um, Stuart. Um, <laughs> They're all, they're all here. All of the Ultramen are here. And they're going to absolutely kick ass. And that's what I'm most excited about. So let's play as Ultraman. And we're going to go up against... No. Um, we're going to go... <laughs> no, we're going to go up against Marvin the Paranoid Android. Um, <laughs> there he is. <laughs> and we're going to head to the city and because this game does something that I love in games like this and that is the fact that you have fully destructible environments <laughs> I love it it's so cheesy but it's so good I, I adore this so much um right this game as I said has destructible environments and there is some serious weight behind your punches in this game. Like, everything feels really heavy. And this might be the best one, I think. I've played four of these games, and I think this is the best one. Uh, there is one more we're going to take a look at after this. <laughs> but I don't think it's as good as this one. It's close. Uh, but this might be the most... Uh, kind of graphically good and also just fun to play. Uh, we're going to grab him. I'm, I'm just going to lift him up and throw him on the ground. <laughs> because why not? <laughs> oh my god. And then we're going to do a special move. I missed it. I didn't press it in time. Hang on. Okay, we're just going to kick his legs out from under him. There's a jet plane attacking him now. <laughs> Uh, we're, <laughs> we're just jumping around. There's nothing happening. <laughs> go! Go, Ultraman! Oh no! We're gonna die! Ow! <laughs> go, go! I jumped over him. I'm that good. Now, I don't say that I'm very good at these games because I'm not. I'm awful. But you can do this. Yeah, I just threw a frisbee at his face. I'm just gonna punch him in the gut again. That's probably my favorite move. Oh! Oh! Ow! <laughs> Come here! No! Are she just smacking me against a building? This is what I loved in Power Rangers. Do you remember that? With all the big mechs they'd have and just battle. That was my favorite part of Power Rangers. I bloody loved that show growing up. <laughs> dead. <laughs> he nearly exploded too. Amazing. But there's one more. And he can also fly. I don't know how he does that. A lot of baked beans probably. And this is the final game we're going to look at today. This is Ultraman Fighting Evolution Rebirth. Because there were three Fighting Evolution games. This is the fourth one i think i i have no idea but this one is good i don't know which is the best i think it was the one we just looked at but let's jump into this one um yes i have no idea what that says but sure right it turns out it was asking me to play the tutorial we don't need this because i am a genius when it comes to ultraman games i am the number one ultraman player um <laughs> since three days ago um <laughs> we're gonna jump in and actually play against some ai now 
if you thought you had ultra men before now we have even more ultra men uh, they even have names this time which they didn't before <laughs> at least not in english so we have ultraman ultra seven ultraman taro ultraman tiga Ultraman Gaia and Ultraman Cosmos and Wargaro <laughs> as well as um, really derpy looking Godzilla, which I love. Eleking may be the, the silliest monster in this game. I love him. Um, so we're going to play as him. <laughs> because why not? Uh, we're going to go up against Ultra 7 and let's play in that city. Yes. There he is. <laughs> right. Come on, Ellie King. You've got this. I believe in you. Okay. We're going to charge up. And we're going to get hit in the face. <laughs> and, and fall over. Right. <laughs> I love his attack. Is literally just to slap the enemy. That's his main move. And I love it. <laughs> He's great. He's bloody brilliant. And then you can just slap him around. I <laughs> what is he doing? Stop it, Ellie King. God, slap him more. <laughs> oh, I love it. It's so good. Now, we're going to use our special ability. This is, um, laser. <laughs> I think. There you go. Does that have the photon torpedo noise from Star Trek? Oh my god! <laughs> that tore him apart! Wow! Okay, let's gra- Ow, stop it! Stop! Let me slap you again! Ow! <laughs> I want to hear what you think in the comments down below. Which is your favourite so far that you've seen? Because uh, they all have different elements. Um, like... Ultraman, just Ultraman, has a really nice thing where you can grab enemies' tails and sling them around. Um, but the other games have destructible environments. So it's a bit of a toss-up which one's actually the best. But I want to hear your opinions on this. <laughs> where is he going? Oh my god. Okay, he beat me. Ow. Oh my god. Oh, and he's powered up. That's not good. Now, it's very rare I get beaten in those button-mashing minigames. I'm actually quite good at doing those. Um, so the AI is super powerful in this game. Oh, no. He's going to hit me with his space laser. Ah, I'm fine. Though. I'm not dead yet. Yes, you, you can't beat me. Oh, he's got a finisher and shit. <laughs> oh, no. Don't do it, Ultra 7. I love the music. <laughs> it's just like doo doo doo. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> He's gone. Ellie King's just evaporated. <laughs> there you have it. That is the wacky world of Ultraman games. Uh, there's another couple, uh, obviously, one and two of the fighting games. Um. I don't know what this video was, and I'm sorry, uh, but I hope, I really hope, this makes you go out and get these games. <laughs> like, play these. Tell me what you think. If you've never heard of these before, comment down below. But until next time, that's me, out. Bye, guys.